Alright, well. What's up? Toxic, back more. Back more. Back with more. Grid. Oh, God. <clears throat> I'm eating one of those little P3 packs. Like, things with little pieces of ham and cheese and almonds and stuff. I legit almost choked on a small piece of ham. That, what a way to go that would have been. Anyway, let's look at the illustrious driver offers we have. Oh, hello. Huh. Hmm. Finished no lower than first in your class. $2.4 million. Well. Okay. Yeah, well. You know how I said we'd probably never... I, I probably said it. I guess I said it. I assume I said that we would probably never do a contract race. We're doing this fucking contract race. I'm gonna win this fucking race. Cars in Le Mans series races are split into four separate classes. Just worry about beating the cars in your class. What a plain ass looking car too. I'm gonna win this fucking race. And get me two point four million dollars. So I can buy one of these cars one of my own of these cars. App Fuck out of the way. Uh, excuse you, dick. But yeah, last night I did a uh, little over an hour of Dirt to Daytona. Need to do more of it. And at some point I need to do NASCAR Thunder 2004. But, uh, I've been enjoying this a lot, so I've been playing a lot more. This is the fifth session of it. I'm pretty sure that's like Audi is that team that that guy drives for. And they're like the best Lamas team. Guy's arms are wiggling when he turns. Yeah, I know. I need to win this race so we can get two hundred, two and a half million dollars. It's very important that I win this race and get two and a half million dollars. That's very important. Oh, this motherfucker is not laying down. And also, uh, weirdly enough. Scratch my eye real quick. Um, let's see. Uh, I think the last Grid game came out in 2014, and it was called Grid Autosport, uh, which I have and I played a little bit, but I didn't play a whole lot of. Okay, we got way ahead of him in the chicane. Good. Well done, Crash. You're leading your class. Good. But uh, I never played it because, well, I didn't really think it was going to be all that great, but I guess I got it on sale at some point. And, uh, it, uh, I, I read, did a little reading. It sounds kind of fun, but, uh, like I said, I never really played it much, but I should try and download it again when I get a chance, get back on the PC. Maybe I'll do that someday. I'll probably play around with it before I ever record it. Okay, yeah, that just worked. Just jumped across the grass, no problem. Um, but the thing, the funny thing, the thing that made me look into Autosport was, apparently they're releasing it on the Switch. <laughs> Four years after its initial release, they're putting it on the Switch. I know this because I follow Codemasters on Twitter. And they're like, yeah, you can race anywhere. And it's like, oh, okay. I'll probably just sit in my house and play it, but, you know, I can take my Switch and play racing games now, I guess. I'll probably just download it. I mean, it, it's... Right, it's there. I mean, unless, uh, I mean, unless like later, in uh, later in time, it's like twenty bucks and I can pick it up. But I don't really, I don't, I don't think a Switch game is gonna be twenty bucks ever. Nintendo have a tendency to not really lower the prices of their games. At least I don't think so. Maybe it's just because I've been. Maybe just maybe it's just the ones that they make. Like, you know, Mario games and shit never seem to drop price. And if they do, it's like to 40 or 30 bucks. It's ridiculous. Like, Pokemon games stay their release price for forever. It's crazy. That's just how Nintendo rolls. And uh, it looks like we're going to get $2.5 million just from, <laughs> just from doing this one race. So, that is funding the Lamaze effort. For sure. Get off the grass. 
could hear the other cars going by. I forget that there are 15 cars in this in this race. There are probably like only seven in my class. Yeah, there they go over there on the mini map. I'm kind of proud of myself. I didn't have to use my flashback. Or either of my flashbacks. This steering wheel is very weird. Why is it like got a weird ass V thing on? Why didn't it just complete the circle? Like, what were they doing here? Like, what was the idea? I said idea weird because I went over a hill and it scared me. Like, what was the idea here with this weird ass V thing going on in the steering wheel? Whatever, we won the race. And we have a winner. Indeed. Now, give me my two and a half million dollars. I like that it says they DNF, but really what happened was they just, they, they didn't finish. They didn't wreck. They just didn't finish because I was so far ahead. Or my class was so far ahead. You're damn right. Well done, Crash. Great win. You're filling our coffers. All right. Let's see what else we can get. Nothing that good. I guess I'll, I guess I'm gonna have to check occasionally, because that was very much worth it. Okay, we've done all that. So yeah, we were doing this. We have one more race in this region. Look, if you're going to race, and I'm gonna have to spend car. almost two. I'm gonna have to spend pretty much all that money I just got on a damn saline. Ah, eh, fuck it. I was buy it new. Well. Whoever that team I drove for, they just funded a brand new saline. I don't know why I like these damn P3 packs. I mean, I don't know what's so appealing about eating. Here's the underdog. He could surprise you. Well, he'll probably beat me in turn one. Oh, yeah, this, is, this one has a little camera. I like that for some reason I pointed at the screen as if you could see it. Like, as if you could see me pointing. Are uh, Saline's American cars? I have no idea what na what region they are. I assume they're either American or they're uh, British. But I genuinely have no clue. Feels very nice to drive, though. It's a little slidey. Oh, it's very slidey. I like Saline's. They're pretty nice cars. I'm in second place. I can see that. Thank you. Once again, giving me information that I do not need. As opposed to giving me information I would like when I want it. Ooh. Yeah, this car is... Loose would be the term I uh, would probably should use in stock car terms. I'm now directly behind you. David Wood. I've never heard of that Nate guy. I was say I've never heard of that name, but... I'm sure I've heard those names before. I've never heard of this guy in particular. A door's opening. And it's a got a suicide style to it. Wait, are, are suicide doors the ones that open the opposite way? I don't remember. I haven't played Deep Speed Underground 2 in, in a long time. And I say that because it had the fucking... Uh you know, all the door options that you could pimp your car out with and get those magazine covers because that's that's the real purpose of that game. Great driving. You got the lead. Ooh. <laughs> 35 miles already on this car. Attractive solutions. I should use that in NR. I should really sit down and just look at all the sponsors in this game and use that for NR. I uh, did that with NASCAR Heat 3 where I just... Like, looked at all the fucking sponsors in that. And then I couldn't find some of them. Like, some of those were, like, the truck teams. I couldn't find good logos for them. It's unfortunate, because some of them were nice sponsors. Well done, Crash. That's your own personal best time on this track. It's also a world record, apparently. Which means my last personal best was a world record, I guess? No, maybe... No, not... No, not necessarily. Oh, Jesus. The fuck? Did I clip the barrier? I guess I did. Well, things are going very smoothly <laughs> so far. I think the we had that, what was it, the second session ended terribly, or was it the first session ended terribly, where I, like, lost, like, three races in a row? I can't rightly remember. But uh, we are absolutely dominating this event. 
I'm still scared to put it on the highest difficulty. Because, I mean, there there's going to be, I feel like there's going to be times where I still struggle to win races. Or I still have to battle to win races. I mean, like I said, I did, I, I always do say that, you know, if it, if things are too easy, I will try and bump the difficulty up and see. All right, good job, Fletch. You got second. I'm going to eat a piece of turkey. Like, these P3 things are just so, I don't know, I genuinely don't know what the appeal in them is, but I like them for some reason. It's like, here, have this little plastic thing that's got a bunch of squares of cheese and squares of turkey or ham. I prefer the ham, to be honest, to turkey. I mean, turkey's fine, but, you know, I prefer ham. You know, it's also got almonds. Did did anyone else see the car behind him with the tires doing a thing? Or is that just me losing my fucking mind? I, I'm almost certain his tires were doing a thing that they... No, no, uh... Could you guys' cars stop doing that? That's really freaking me out. Put your fucking tires back in your fucking cars, guys. That's weird. I've never seen that before. I probably just never noticed it. It's probably happened before, but I probably just never noticed it. Aha, I get fucked. Oh, shit. Now I'm the one getting fucked. Because I didn't realize what configuration we were on. But Grid Autosport has, uh, has drag racing. It's a DLC, though. I should wait. I don't have any of the DLC. I should wait for... Uh, the good old Christmas sale. Um, so I'm assuming they're going to have one. They usually do. Winter sale, New Year sale, whatever. And hopefully it'll be on, some of that stuff will be on sale. I can uh, pick it up because it's like, it's, it seems kind of cool. It's like old looking, like a stock car dragsters, like, you know, Plymouths and shit. But it also looks like it has some like top fuel looking cars too. So maybe they have like different classes in that. I don't know, I have to look it up. I have to look up videos of it. Oh shit. And I left a bumper back there. The car is very sturdy. Oh good, it's only two laps. Let's do a sick drift. That nah, wasn't that sick. Oh shit. Yeah, don't pass me, just yeah. AI really don't know how to do wreck avoidance at all. All they know is, oh, cars in front of me? Better slow down. Like, I didn't even intentionally block the track. I just backed up and was like, oh, they're going to go around me. No, they never do. Oh, shit. Why? Why are you in last? What did you do? What did you do, Fletcher? What 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 colossal fuck up did you have? Like seriously, what? <laughs> I have to. I only. I imagine whenever he is in last, it's because something happened. Like he wrecked, or he or, or something happened, or one of the AI in front of him wrecked, or some shit like that. Like he's never that bad by himself. It's always something else had to happen. I do want to try and see if there's anyone better than him. I know there are people that are higher ranked than him that you can get, but he's always been the one that's most consistent. Oh, maybe that's what happened. Oh, wait, no, that was me that hit that tire barrier back there, wasn't it? Oof, Jesus, that was close. Victory cheese piece. Yeah, he just finished. I, I should have seen how far back he was, though. That would have told me something. We're still ahead of Team Bristol by 14 points, so. Get that team win bonus. But yeah, a lot of these sponsors would be kind of cool. Obviously not speed, because speed doesn't exist, but so maybe some nice sponsors there, some different ones. I keep doing this, I realize I could just look at the little camera. 
Just glance over there at the, in the left side of my car. Get your fucking tires back in your cars, mate. Like, all of you. Maybe it's something to do with this car, because that's I've never seen that before. Oh. Someone died. Ow. Let's see who died real quick. I guess he just drove into a tire thingy. Like, is there sometimes like those just little like, not like a full tire barrier, but it's like a fucking stack of tires. They're just like that right there. Where it's like blocking a uh, side of a wall that's sticking out. Can't wait to do more fucking. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm eating almond. <sighs> you disappoint me so many, so much sometimes. Is he? Shit, fam. I, there's no way I would have known that. Why did I say fam? What the fuck? I never say that. What the fuck is my problem? You literally just told me that about like a like two yards back. You don't need to tell me again. Out in front. Yeah, tell me that Lex. Tell me that he's leading in as many ways as possible. Just let me know in as many ways as possible that that dude is leading. Oh shit! I didn't really need to use this, but whatever. Fuck it. I probably didn't have to use it. Well, what happened there? What the fuck is that, by the way? That giant green thing. What is that? <laughs> what, did they, what did they put in my car? Oh, shit. That's a very high-speed part of the track, and it's terrifying. And what part of the track? Ahead of me or behind me? Because if it's ahead of me, I'm calling bullshit. If it's behind me, well, I can't really call bullshit on that. Oh, great, this almost stuck in my throat. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not catching Lexel. I don't know where the fuck he was the last two races, but... I hope not. Oh, shit. Don't you fucking get out. I know. There's bumper to my other car sitting back there. Shut the fuck up about Kurt Lexall. I swear to God, I will fire you if I could. I don't have any power over you, honestly, but I fucking wish I could. What? What? What is the? What is the fucking percentage chance of him saying these things? Because sometimes he won't say shit during a race. So it's like you and Kurt Lexall. Like some races, he will. He will just. He won't say shit. He will just be as quiet as can be. But in a two-lap race, he has managed to tell me that this dude was the leader about seven or eight times. Like, really? I don't need to... Jiro Yamada DNF'd. I guess he was the guy that hit the fucking tire barrier on the first lap. Damn, Fletch. Well... Still won the overall team title, so we get that bonus. So that's always nice. Holly's like, yeah, we'll chip in a good 7k for you just existing. Nice race. That'll improve our bottom line. Will it? Oh shit, we made 1.5 million dollars. I didn't even notice. Alright, some new sponsors. Let's see if they're worth a shit. Ooh, that's real nice. But we're going to put it on that. Because I want to keep speed. And it's no lower than fifth. That's real good. Um, No lower than first, no lower than first, no lower than third. <laughs> finish the race. We're not going to find many. They're going to say, like, finish the race. We'll give you money. Okay, that's about as good as it's going to get. We can go with 
good old grams for that. And holly for that. There we go. All right. Oh, 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 you want to race me in the Viper? Okay, the car that I, one of the cars that I like the most in this game. Sure, yeah, let's go, McCain or whatever the other guy's asshole name is. Ravenwest Motorsport are a class act. Just do your best, kid. You can't do more. I can fucking win. It did have to be on a track that I fucking hate, though. That's how they. That's how they get me. It's like here we're gonna drive. We're gonna race in the cars that you like. We're gonna do it on a track that you hate. It's like oh, you motherfuckers, you devious bastards. Oh shit! I cut that way too soon. Come here, Nathan. I need you to not be as fast as you are right now. Or two million dollars, man. I need that money. You don't. You guys make like seventy-seven million dollars a year, which is fucking ridiculous, if you ask me. I don't know how the hell they do that. Which reminds me. I wonder if the I don't. I'm gonna assume that that two and a half million I made doesn't go towards my team money-making total for the year. It probably goes towards that team's. Oh shit! I can't afford to make a mistake. I really need to, like, get my shit together. If I'm ahead of him, I make a little mistake. It's fine. But if I'm behind him, I'm not so sure I could catch him again. Because he's not going to fuck up. Because he's fucking Raven West. Even though both him and the other dude... Whose fucking name I am forgetting. Oh, shit. Got some slight sick air. Him and the other dude were, like, just terrible in that one drift event. That one time. And then, and then he just, like, beat the shit out of me in the last run of it. Come here, you fucker. Okay, we're, we're back in the part of the track that I'm good at. Oh, my God. I think both of us just slid like motherfuckers right there. That was impressive. Okay. I'm good at this part of the track. Come here, McCain. You fuck. Come on. I don't know if him and uh the other dude... Show up in Autosport or not? But I know that Raven West. I thought my door fell off, but no, it was just it just blew out my window. Eep. Bitch, come back here! Oh fuck! <laughs> yeah, that's about right. Fucking nailed him. Every, no, everything goes in a Raven West showdown, my friend. No punches get pulled here. He's got to park the car on the racing line. He won't be able to do shit. Go away. Your car got a little banged up, but it's nothing serious. Oh, I'm well aware. As hard as I hit him, I'm surprised he didn't go flying through the air. Go away. car slid a little more than I wanted to, but luckily, like I said, if you just stay on the racing line, they don't really want to pass you. I just gotta get through this stupid part with this, all this fucking grass that makes me fucking paranoid that I'm gonna touch it and go spinning out. I don't have any more flashbacks, so this is it. See, once you're in front of them, you can just really kind of just dictate... The, you can just make it where they can't pass you because they will not go off the fucking racing line. And they will not attempt to pass you. Oh shit, he almost got underneath me there. Fucking switching views like an idiot. Oh god. His left side is fucked up though, you can see on the front left. 